Well, hello! Welcome to the part where... well, the part after we got them all. Uh, oh. <laughs> okay, I guess we didn't get them all. Okay, the real rider is still there. But surely it's only one. Just take it out. Uh-oh. Dodge it. Please. Whoa! Sheesh, I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> you have a point there. You do have a point there. <sighs> nice heterochromia there, Solar. Just what what are you talking about? Jeez, we don't need you asking questions as well. We want some answers. Okay, you've gone back. Well, the orange, I guess. I don't know. Well, okay, good. You yielded. Good, good. The seraphim is powered down. Oh, even more of them? O okay, fine. Oh, jeez, what's it gonna do? <sighs> okay, all riders, fall back. We're getting out of here. Hmm? Uh oh. Come on, emergency landing procedures. We're getting out of here. Good. Okay, good. <laughs> Spool up warp drive. Warp, warp, get us out of here. Whew. <laughs> Try out running an explosion in a cruiser like this. Oh, what happened to the Reuvian ships? I <laughs> guess I didn't need to ask. Uh, all that lost technology. It's so sad. Ah, uh, all right. Stand down, red alert. Okay, good. Just in time. I'm surprised we managed to get her. Let's go down there. She's the only clue we have at figuring out what happened back there. I'm Captain Kato Shields. Welcome aboard the Sunrider. What's your name? Prince. Wait a second. Uh, uh, <laughs> hold on. My friend's just trying to piece some things together at them. You, the princess who's been missing from Ryuvia all this time. I know! <laughs> She's been dead for 2,000 years? Why didn't you tell me that? Well, I guess... Uh, I guess I didn't really need to know. I guess we were looking for a different... I mean, I mean we weren't even looking for you. I... I, 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 so many questions. Okay, why did you attack us? Hmm... The Fallen, huh? Uh, suddenly, this sounds like Shogo, too. Utter destruction, indeed. Not destroyed enough. Uh, I'm not sure I follow what she's saying, but it seems like she attacked us by mistake. Uh, do you know who destroyed all those Ryuvian ships? The ultimate weapon of Sharlak, the final tier. <laughs> the ultimate sacrifice. <laughs> the Sharlak? She must be referring to the Super Dreadnought. To 
think that a single ship was capable of such destruction. It could destroy entire systems. Huh. The ultimate sacrifice. <laughs> I mean, sacrifice. Oh dear, I don't like where this is going. Were you, what were you doing on board that super dreadnought? In battle? You mean before you were frozen? Who are you fighting? Who are they? Well, I doubt they're existing any longer. <laughs> the Pretender Crow Harbor. I like that name. She's not revealing much. It sounds like she's referring to some kind of civil war within Ryuvia during her time period. Hmm. You've been frozen for over two millennia on board that ship. She looks kind of sad now. <laughs> you must be even more shocked than us. Uh, welcome to the future. Not that much has changed, I guess. Or at least not technology-wise. I don't know. It happened so long ago. Much of our knowledge of your time has been lost. <laughs> ah. Well, that's enough questions. Uh, we are seeking a Ryuvian artifact known as the Crown Jewel. Do you know where to find it? Mm hmm. The Talber. Oh, good. Well, that's convenient. Hey, yeah. Please, go get it. Whoa. That's what it is. <laughs> I didn't expect something quite like that. Oh, that's neat. No? Then who's it glowing for? What's wrong? How oh, packed, they'll never leave us alone. How do they follow us here? They're not following us, are they? Oh well, let's see. Come on people, return to battle stations. What's our status? Huh? How many? What are they here for? Spool up the warp drive, get ready to... Ah. Uh. <sighs> Pork chops. <laughs> uh. You know, you seem a bit afraid. What you're doing right here is... is overkill. Hmm, you want that, huh? And what would Pact want with it? Runaway Bride. So that's it. Venizar Arcadius's Bride. The Princess of Ryuvia's engaged to Arcadius. No wonder she's run away, yeah. Haha. <laughs> Ah, oh, jeez! This is a tough, tough decision. Ah, <laughs> uh, I know our crew is behind us, but... We can't... Ah... Uh, let's see... Do we promise it? I do... Nah... <laughs> I'm, pretty I'm pretty sure he considers this pretty personal at this point. Uh likely would not let us live, even if that were the case. Uh, you can take the crown jewel from my cold, dead hands. You knew it would come to this. Gah! <laughs> Launch the riders! Oh. Done. I'm sorry, Ava. Is this the end? It's all right, Ava. She all smiled wryly and held onto Ava's hand. Been an honor.
<laughs> uh huh. <laughs> you put up a pretty good guys. <laughs> All this time? How could I have never known? <laughs> well, it's not like we knew any other princesses or anything much about the Reuvians. And don't beat yourself up over it. <sighs> Asaga. This isn't our farewell. Get our repair drones online. We've got a wedding to crash. Oh man. This. Oh no, this isn't gonna end well, is it? Legion, huh? The super dreadnought. So this is. I don't suppose this is where you're he having your uh, wedding? Hmm. Oh, jeez. This is not going to be pretty. <laughs> oh, well, good. At least things will be ordered in some way. <laughs> Usual habits. Oh, no. <laughs> Venice Fontana. Hmm. All right, 38 hours later. Yeah, you've been doing well. Ah. Yes, please see if you can get more of those drones. Let's, let's see what's the situation on Ruvia. Venisar's flagship? Yeah. Four fleets. How are we gonna do this? Hmm. Asuka's a member of our crew. I'm not going to abandon her. I know that what you say is true, but not if we have a plan. Chigara, come in. Tell us what you've managed to devise from looking at the data we've gathered from the Seraphim. Hmm. <laughs> Substantial navigational upgrades, huh? Oh. That is pretty accurate. Huh. <laughs> According to Alliance Intel, the marriage will take place in low orbit around Ryuvia in the Star Palace. We'll make a pinpoint jump right next to the wedding hall, pick Asuga up, then hightail it out of Ryuvia before the packed fleet can respond. One thing at a time, Ava. 
will have the element of surprise. Nobody will expect the Sunrider to walk past the entire packed fleet and come out on top of the Star Palace. I'm going to protect everyone on this ship, Ava. Nobody gets left behind. Not when I'm the captain. Everyone's dismissed. <sighs> All right. Well, at least we have a plan, so we won't have to fight past that. Well, the four fleets. That would be very ugly. <sighs> All right. Let's have a word with Chigara here. Are you wanting to see me? <laughs> Don't sweat it. Yeah, you were just trying to protect Asuka. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Hmm. For how long has she been doing this? How did you find out Asuga was the princess? Huh. <laughs> of course. <laughs> ah, so it's your hair ribbon that does that. That's very neat. <laughs> yeah, the story was quite different when we heard it from Asuga. But more importantly, your hair ribbon can do that. Oh, oh, music, time, a flashlight, and keep your hair clean. Man, your hair ribbon really is indispensable. Ah, I need one of those. Hmm. <laughs> An adventuring princess, huh? Pact is nothing more than a tyrannical regime led by a madman. Venzar Arcadius will never honor a political alliance with Ryuvia. Hmm. Don't worry, Chigara. We'll go in there and rescue Asuka before the Venizar can even lay a finger on her. This is going to be our hardest mission yet. Prepare yourself. Good. We'll be counting on your expertise to pull this off. Mm. A holo recording? Thanks, I'll take a look at it in my office. Hmm, <laughs> definitely. Alright, our office, eh? We shall have a look at that in a little bit, after we see what everyone else is up to. Oh boy, well, let's see what Claude is up to. Ice cream! Alright, I have time to chat. <laughs> Have some subtlety. There's an art to subtlety. No thanks. 
<laughs> Do you flirt with every single space captain you happen to meet, Claude? Alright, sorry I asked. That's not what... <laughs> oh dear. Well... Sure, but Ava will be after me with chains if she saw me with you, let's say. Oi! <laughs> I think we have regulations against that. We went to high school together, that's all. We used to be pretty close back in the days, but it's not like we were dating or anything. I guess she's always been more like an older sister. <laughs> You wouldn't know half of it. So, what are you going to do now? <laughs> that poor ship. I think I feel sorry for the ship more than anything else. <laughs> uh. mm, I wouldn't count on becoming a doctor here, but you still help us out with those Reuvian cruisers. We could use a pilot like you. Alright, just, uh, no more medical exams. I'll take care of my own health. And, yeah, more like just to fuel your own perversions. Uh, Ava says that you've been causing her problems. Ah, uh, look. Uh, let's see. <laughs> I know Ava can be frustrating at times, but she's only doing her job. Can't you two at least try to get along? What? Uh, oh, Claude? Quit falling around! Your ice cream's melting. You're kidding me. <laughs> I'm going to back to work now. Enjoy your ice cream. <laughs> I cannot figure her out. You know what, let's save it quickly. Let's see what Solar has to say. You must be confused. Trust me, you're among the living again. Uh, hmm. What do you plan on doing now? I guess there, though, there's not really much you can do when you're two millennia out of your time zone. We'll give you a purpose, somehow. <laughs> You'll find new friends here with us. You can rebuild your life. Like a family connected not by blood, but by bonds. What kind of existence did you live two millennia ago? You're just lonely. I don't know what happened to you before you ended up in that tube, but you can join our crew here on aboard the Sunrider. <laughs> Tell me more of your time. Drastic measures? Like what? Uh, awakening, you say? You mean the super dreadnought we found in that graveyard? Uh. 
Hmm. Interesting. Who would make such a weapon? It just sounds like a fantasy legend, not the stuff of real life. <sighs> a war became horrible. Well, you don't say. the Holy Ruvian Empire. But despite that, your father still chose to sacrifice you to awaken the Sharlak. You unleashed the Sharlak's final weapon in that battle and destroyed all those ships. But I thought you were supposed to die after you did that. Why is it that you're still alive? Well, sorry. Your eye was glowing during the battle. What was that? I've never seen anything like that before. Uh, that's got to be the most deadpan joke ever. It's almost like quiet. Hmm. Huh. So everyone during your time possessed superhuman abilities? Gah. Makes sense. Ruvian rulers would want to use such powers to make themselves more powerful. Hmm, well, we need help. The technology of your time far surpasses our own. Help us rescue our friend. Ryuvia needs your help. Okay, but still, help us rescue Asaga. We could really use your skills out there. You are quite brave. We're all going to come out of this alive. Watch yourself out there. Aye, aye. Well, then. I think next time we'll, uh, well, we'll go and get some research done and see what Asuka left on that uh, holovid for us. Oh boy, I sure hope we can get her back in one piece. <laughs> of course we will. No doubts, no doubts. Only confidence. I'll see you next time, everyone, for some... Uh, royal shenanigans, I guess. <laughs> oh, this is going to be absolutely crazy. It had better work. It had better work. Alright, bye for now.